Get the hell away from me. Oh my god. What the hell is that? What the hell? It's just a computer. Alright, bring me in. What the fuck? What is that noise? What's this loadout? He brings glass mining, bro. And I can't play shit. Okay. Okay, I see how this is. It's parkour. But oh shit, we made it. What the fuck? There's nothing over here. I think we were supposed to fall down. But I gamed it. Oh shit! What the fuck? What is this? Uh, I guess this is where we're supposed to be. Where are we? This looks really beautiful, Loki. Oh, hole. Let's go through it. Oh, magnifying glass. A chair. Can't sit in it. Useless. Where are we supposed to go? We need a passcode. 6969. Six, Shit. You have to remember, the monster's stuck in here with me, not the other way around. He should be scared of me. I'm not scared of him. Oh, we found something. So we got number one. Clearly walls and shit don't exist here. Because I'm going in circles. Oh shit. Okay, so this is the order. So triangle's last, and that was one. So we need square and circle. So something that ends in one. Isn't there supposed to be monsters in here? Three. There's a three and a one. Let's do the smart thing. Brute force. Got it. Yep, I definitely found that number. We And I am back where I started. Maybe? Ooh. Paper. We're a scientific crew which was sent to explore the mysterious back rooms. We're four. Me, Maria, as the expedition's leader, Simon, who brought his friend Arthur with us, is my second, and Judy, who joined us at the last minute. We started by exploring an area which seems like a maze with yellowish wallpaper dotted with arrows. The buzzing of the neons is starting to be exhausting. It's really easy to get lost in those corridors, so I ask everyone to stick together as long as we're in this area. Well, clearly they didn't if I have their paper. Nice game playing, guys. Where am I? Ooh. His W. Another hole. Oh shit. Look at that smoke. I feel like someone's gonna jump out and try and scare me, but I don't get scared. It's the same stuff over and over again. It's gonna make me mad. I want a new environment. And I'm back here? How the hell? I've already been down that hole. Pause. At this W? So I'm collecting words, I guess. Just kind of running around. I don't know where I've looked and where I haven't. In between the poles. Maneuverability test. I feel like I've already been down there, but fuck it. Part two. Right here. Wall. At. This. Keep looking at this wall. As I move backwards. Is this 200 IQ? I think I'm really smart. And it worked. Look at this ladder. Look at that. Don't move. Stay still. Run. Okay, it's got eerily quiet. It wants me to go the other way. Oh, fuck. What the hell are you? Stay the fuck away. Stay away. Get the hell away from me. Oh, shit. Fuck you. Why am I low-key shaking, bro? Oh my god, bro. He comes around every corner. He's like me. He just keeps coming. Why does it sound like he's fapping? I'm stuck in an infinite loop. This is my Groundhog's Day. But except for, you know, getting the love of my life, I have to hear this dude wink his stuff.
just starting to get annoying. So he spawns there. Let's go this way. Nope. Can't go that way. Can't go backwards. Can't go that way. So it just all comes down to... Oh, there we go, finally! Holy crap. Thank God. I'm starting to lose my mind. What are we, level 2 now? What the hell is this? Little kid's party? What the hell? Oh, look. Oh, what the hell? Oh, so I can't go out in the dark? I might get it now. These lights might be the ones I can hit. So I need to get that corner one. Yeah, there we go. I figured it out. So these lights are the ones I have to go to. So this one will be that corner. This one will be that corner. And all the other ones will kill me. Hey! Let's go down here. Okay, we're in a new room. A coin. I'll take one flashlight, please. Oh, I need five coins. Paper. We're in an area that looks like a really degrade parking lot. I saw several smilers in the dark, which make those areas particularly dangerous. We can't progress in those places unless we light them first or use our flashlights. Judy is starting to feel anxious about this place and doesn't act as usual. I think she's really afraid of this place. We carry on the explorations despite the menace. Okay. So, find coins, get a flashlight. There we go. We got a flashlight. Oh, that's pretty sick. I like swag. Okay. No, the music. Not not frightening at all. Sound not frightening. Oh, move box. Okay, it seems to be the same thing, just the opposite direction. Oh, and the anvil's the anvil's not here on that one. Oh, so we have to go back and forth and. Uh, so we just have to do this a bunch where we just keep switching. So it's like two different planes of existence. Some of them, those anvils exist, some of them they don't. So we just keep having to switch which ones we go to. Big ass hallway. What is this? What the fuck? What is this? I didn't think I was making any progress, but I'm guessing I'm in this giant room now. Looks beautiful after all that darkness. Thank God I can see now. It's amazing. Now I'm going into the light. Look at this. So beautiful. Holy shit. Oh, pool. Staircase. And there's this. This is an infinite staircase. You cannot go up. Oh my God. As far as I can see, it's. All this pool stuff. I right, saw. Let's, let's pass it through. Ooh, paper. We're in an area filled with pools of all sizes. From here, we can see the sun's light, which is comforting after all the time in the dark. I saw Judy and Arthur going away from us, and suddenly Arthur fell in the water. Judy tried to help him since he doesn't know how to swim, but the configuration of the room wasn't helping, and she couldn't do anything. We need to carry on and find a way out before we lose someone else. I need to do that for Arthur. So they just left bro to die in the water. Sick, sick bastards. Let's turn my shaders off. Okay, so now you can actually fucking see. Of course. Of course I had to turn off my shaders. I was like, why is it so dark? Clearly I'm missing something. Don't look away. Oh shit. Oh my god. What the hell is that? Oh my god. What the fuck? The noises in this is crazy. Jump! Yeah! Fuck you. Bro fell. He's all the way down there. Hey, it's brighter. Thank god. Thank god I can see now. I had to turn off the shaders, sadly. Turn them back on after I'm out of this section. It's parkour. Easy. Oh shit, if you're in the water for too long, it starts killing you. Oh, there's a lever. Oh, it drains the water. 
I'm like speedrunning this now because I've done it so many times. Let's go. Please. Let's go. <laughs> Thank God. Oh my God. Please tell me. It's, please tell me it's not upside down now. Oh my God, bro. Okay. Should be easier, right? Okay, so this is much easier. We don't have to do all that pushing stuff again. Thank God. So this is upside down now, too. Shit. There we go. Thank God, bro. Oh, shit. Level 4. Finally. Thank God we're out of that one. What are we in? Home Depot? What is this? We're in a place similar to Hygienic Library, except that all the shelves are empty. We noticed the surveillance system linked to a computer. Judy decided to go explore with Simon, but she came back alone. I'm really worried for our security and for her. Her behavior is really starting to get concerning. She must be shocked by the death of Arthur and Simon. We must continue to explore the back rooms to find our way out into the real world. Oh my god, we're playing Five Nights at Freddy's now. Oh, so you can play Sound to Lure him? Okay, so let's go now. Run. It's gotta be up here on the right. Yes, sir. Get me out. A wood axe. Oh, now we can break these. What? Oh. Where am I? Snack paradise? What the hell? Almond water? What? I'm allergic. Oh, what the hell? It's me. Run. Run, boy, run. He's behind you. Don't look back, brother. Oh, am I playing? Oh, I can jump. This is cool. If I click, he jumps. Played my fair share of mobile games to do this. Well, I don't think I'm running through it from anything anymore. There we go. Did we do it? through this door hey oh my god Mariah and I arrived at an empty skyscraper the grassy floor almost like some leafy corridors Mariah began to suspect me about the death of Simon and Arthur I knew she would try to stop me realizing my dream so like Simon and Arthur I tried to kill her but she managed to hurt me hurt me pretty bad before I can end her I know I won't last long now, but I'm happy because I would finally be able to pursue my dream to stay here forever. I know what I, I know want I did, and I don't regret anything. This place is so wonderful. I don't want to leave it. I want to stay here forever, stay here forever, stay forever, 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 forever. Okay. Not me though. Let's get out of here. Ooh. It's like a break in the matrix. We've escaped. Oh shit. Oh, it's my diamonds. Oh, it's me. Oh shit, it's me. It is literally me. Oh fuck. That's when I got hit in. What the hell? 